Ah, the Caribbean, where laid back vibes meet reggae rhythms, palm trees, coconuts, and a hint of pirate lore. And then there's us. Hey, how's it going? We're looking for the road to luck. Kind of lost. So friendly, the locals. So we came to the Dutch island Bonaire, located just off the coast of Venezuela. We found a tropical heaven, but also beautiful nature with quite interesting wildlife. But more about that in the next video. In this one, we're just arriving on Bonaire, making use of the steady trade winds from December to April for my windsurf coaching experience and for windsurfing in one of the most beautiful places I've ever windsurfed. Together with three sisters who could potentially be the next generation of windsurfing heroes. Good morning to everyone straight from Bonaire. We came last night into this amazing little beach apartment. We haven't seen anything last night because it was pitch dark. We arrived in the middle of the night, but apparently we woke up in paradise. I would say first, let's do a little spot check. It's right around the corner here at the Jaip city center. And then let's see if we can get maybe straight some action on the water. Warm and windy, what else do you want? What a paradise, huh? Unreal. When I was a teenager or when I was a kid, I was watching these freestyle kids from the island here doing these crazy tricks and always wanted to come here. So now we're here. What a setup, it's incredible. Beautiful colors, palm trees, warm. Oh my God, can't believe we're here. I'm gonna run a clinic. People from all over the world came again to uh, learn some things from me, so that's super cool. And then we spent a couple of extra days here uh, to get some action on the water and experience the island. And super stoked to take you guys along. It's gonna be fun. I mean, look around, there are no words to describe this. If you could build the perfect windsurf spot for free riding, you would build it like this. You have a bar over there, you have a restaurant, you have a super well equipped center with all the gear. Oh yeah. Hola. We've got Antonio here from uh, Dominican Republic. Amazing. We've got Dero from Germany coming in. Oh. It's a bit too straight in this in the dive, a bit too stiff in the body. So he's gotta bend his knees a bit more. But he's got good commitment. Everyone's committed.
Haus. Nein! Was denkst du von mir? How was the clinic? Perfect. Yeah? Yeah. What did you learn? Ah, oh, planning to achieve spirit. Tequila drinking. Cheers! 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 Cheers. 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 Five, six days, full on wind every day. It dips a bit during the noon time, which is perfect for lunch or tequila shot, you know? And then you go back to the water with loose hands. The clinic is going super well, the group is making good progress. Just a few hints here and there, you know, can make a big difference in your planning and your jive. So super stoked about that. And uh, yeah, they came from everywhere. It's always so good to see for me how dedicated people are. They came from, some came from Dominican Republic, US, Europe. So from all over the world and uh, it's super cool, good vibe. We're having a good time here. And before we see more places on this island, let me tell you a few things about this spot. Let's call it a mini spot guide. This is Sorbonne Beach. The water is as blue as it gets. Wind is typically good from around December to April, they told us. We're here in December, so it's just starting to get good. You have a couple of surf centers just along this beach. Obviously, we're staying over there at Jibe City. Pretty good gear selection, actually, for, the, for rental gear. You don't really need to bring your own stuff unless uh, you're like me and you want your own race gear. Perfect flat water. There's like a little bit of chop, but not really bothersome. Out there, some waves. I know there's a wave spot over there, which we're gonna check out as well, but it's perfect beginner conditions. If you wanna learn to windsurf, and also especially here for the clinic, it's just perfect because you can stand everywhere. It's way steep need to waste deep so yeah it's hassle free and that's what you want if you learn something you don't want any you don't want any concern in your head and here you don't have that so I like it a lot it's like a bathtub what, what's the water temperature do you know it must be, I don't know, but it feels like 25 degrees. Yeah, it must be around 25, maybe more than 25 degrees. Like you go in and it doesn't feel cold at all. So you can windsurf in board shorts and that's like the dream. Don't even need to put on a wetsuit. Maybe Lycra shirt for sun protection. The sun is pretty strong here. But now it was time to see what else we can find on this island. Just packing up, traveling light at least for hours then. <laughs> We're doing a beach trip. Plan is to go to the other side of the island today. We've windsurfed a lot in Sorbonne, a Jaip city. So today we want to see something else. So we're packing the car to go over to, I think they call this, call it Pink Beach. It's supposed to be very nice. Not sure if it's pink, but it's what they call it. And uh, we'll see how it will be. They're putting asphalt on this road. They're working on the right thing. Because uh, a lot of the roads here don't have asphalt. <laughs> the roads here in general are, are pretty rough. Wow, that, that's really pink. So that's that's something you don't see every day. Those are the salinas. I don't know what you call that, that in English, but basically where they produce salt. Got offshore wind we're on the other side of the island so the wind passes quite freely doesn't seem so gusty so I'm pretty sure you can sail quite close to the shore here and get some real flat water
So the ABC Islands, Aruba, Bon Air, Curaçao have over the years seen a lot of windsurfing talents emerging. Some talented freestylers and over the past seasons I have been competing with Tati and Amaro in the Racing World Tour. We also got to know three motivated talented young sisters who have moved here with their parents who are running the Jibe City Center to live the dream with the goal of becoming professional windsurfers one day. Let me introduce. Hello, I'm Mobilen and I'm 13 years old. Hi, I'm Lone and I'm 12 years old. Hello, I'm Kit and I'm 12 years old. So, three sisters here from Bonaire and now we're gonna go on the water and have some fun, right? Let's go. I think everyone should windsurf because it's super fun and super healthy and when you windsurf, you, all you think about is just windsurfing. It's super fun, you get freedom, and you can go fast on the water, and it keeps your mind clean. Uh, my personal goal is, of course, to become world champion, but I also think it's uh, super important to have fun. Surfing in my dream spots and living my dream. I really want to travel around the world and be a world champion one day. Nice, eh? Very nice. Kids beach. having fun. Whoa. Where's your set of gear? <laughs> Where your gear is too. <laughs> At home. <laughs> Everything for the girls, man. better way to end the evening and the video with a beautiful sunset session. This is always the best ending. Thank you so much for tuning in and following us along. Be sure to subscribe if you're not yet. And then also there's gonna be a giveaway. So we're gonna give something away of something very special for you. So right here, I'm not wearing it because it's too warm for that here. That's the Surf Center Windbreaker. So it's like a rain jacket and windbreaker. And it's obviously in the Surf Center signature black. But wherever you are right now, I'm assuming it's not too warm for that. So we're gonna give one away. We had some issues in the past with scams, so leave your email address in the link below and leave a comment, be subscribed, and you can win this amazing windbreaker rain jacket. And uh, we also have a couple of other things, some new merchandise in the store. For example, these, uh, these sweatpants shorties, also Surf Center stuff. So everything is in the Surf Center store now. New t-shirts, new hoodies, uh, some really cool stuff. Be sure to check it out. And with that, I would say, See you guys in the next video. Bye.